Okay, we've got to find the angle BAC, so we go from B to A to C, and it's going to be this angle here. Okay, sounds good, doesn't it? All right, let's have a go at this. So for our 18-sided polygon, there's a couple of ways that we can find angle... So the 18-sided polygon is going to be larger, so... Um, oh yeah, it actually tells us BAE. So BAE, okay, there are two ways to calculate this. And I think I'm going to talk through both. The first way is to realize that, um, okay, for any polygon, it's the number of sides minus 2 times 180. That gives you the interior angle sum. Now, it's a regular polygon, so all of the angles are the same, and there's 18 of them. And therefore, the answer for BAE is, is this. Um, and I can actually work this out without a calculator, I've just realized, because if I divide by 18, then I can, I'm just going to, 180 divided by 18 is just 10, so I can actually just get rid of that 8. 180, yeah, that works. And then I'm going to get uh, 18 minus 2 is 16, so I'm going to get 160. Now, just so you're aware, another, just to remind you, like another way that you can work out angle BAE is to do the exterior angle, and the exterior angles always add up to 360. Um, actually, I'm just going to write it here. And then we've got, again, 18 of them. So to work out a single uh, exterior angle, I would divide by 18. Now, the interior angles, like if I get a polygon like this, so I've just worked out this, the interior angle will be 180 minus that. So I would do 180 minus 360 divided by 18, which is 20, and I would again get 160 degrees. So I don't mean to be overcomplicating it here. I'm just showing you there's two, two ways to do this question. Either use interior angle sum or use exterior angle sum and then 180 minus the exterior angle. Both are worth knowing, basically. So anyway, we found BAE. All right, I'm going to do the same for uh, CAD, so angle... C, A, D. I think this time I'll use the exterior angles. So it's going to be, to work out the exterior angle, it will be 360 divided by 10, because there are 10 of them. Um, and then to get the interior angle, I would do 180 minus that, which is going to be 180 minus 36, because when I divide by 10, that just goes. And that's going to give me 144. So, what's gonna what's happening here? Um, there's a it says there's a dashed line through A, which is the line of symmetry, and therefore I can say that this angle is gonna be 160 divided by two, which is 80, and then. This angle here is going to be my 144 divided by 2, which is 72. And therefore, angle BAC will be the difference between those. It will be 80 minus 72. It's going to be 8 degrees. Okay, happy with that? Nice.